Hello everyone. We want to discuss a question from Gate 2015 CS paper. This question is based on DBMS concept. So the question says consider two relations R1 which is having two attributes A and B with tuples 1 5 and 3 7. Another relation is R2 having two attributes A and C. The tuples are 1 7 and 4 9. Assume that R having the attribute A B C is the full natural outer join of R1 and R2. Consider the following tuples form uh, of the form A B C. Uh, those tuples are given as a A B C D E F and G. Which one of the following statements is correct? So R1 contains A, B, C, A, B, E, F, G, but not C and D. R contains all of A, B, C, D, E, F, G. R contains E, F, G, but not A and B. R contains E, but not F, G. Right. So to know more detail about this topic, you may follow the NPTEL course on database management system by Professor Partha Pratim Das. Let us go for the solution. So R1 consists of uh, R1 having two attributes A and B. The tuples are as follows. R2 has two attributes A and C. Now what we want to do, we want to do a natural join and it's a full outer join. So it will be on the common attribute. So definitely it's a on A. So if you look at here, if you consider the first tuple over here, so here A matches with this A. So I will get a tuple, right? That is one, five, seven. So this is 157. So 3 do not have any matching on the right hand side. That's R2. So from R1 I'll get 37, 37 and for R2 I'll get a null because it is a outer join and full outer join again. Then for R1, uh, sorry for R2, this 4 is not matching with anything on the R1 on the left hand side. So from R2 we get 4 and 9, from R1 we get a null. So this is what we are getting. Now if we check out our options that A, B, C, D, E, F, G, basically you can find out we are getting E, F, G here but not A and B. So that is basically our option C. So let us go back here. So this is the option C. R contains EFG but not AB, right? So this is the correct answer. Hope you understood this. Thanks for watching.